Hey YouTube, a uh, quick video I wanted to do um, before I hack down all my sugar cane. Actually, I already hacked down all the sugar cane and um, took out all the old and underneath um, I laid down about 20 feet of canes in there, cut them up into like four foot sections, laid them in there. <clears throat> so, kind of, I should have uprooted all the remaining canes that are shooting up but I decided to leave those in there since they're new but anything <clears throat> anything that was old um, I pulled up so what I did was these are only the five that are remaining I already probably harvested probably uh, 12 more or so <clears throat> they're decent size they're probably about eight feet long um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to wash them off. I'm going to use a little bit of uh, detergent with a rag and get all the uh, get all this this like city mold on there, um, <clears throat> and then cut them into little sections. And maybe I, what I will do is I'll um, remove the nodes, that's those sections, and plant those sections in pots so I could have you know some more. You know, it's always good. <clears throat> oh yeah, and one thing I wanted to show is. Uh, the mangoes that I have on my tree. Um, this is the rosy gold. Um, I mean, it's doing really well. I mean, mangoes are everywhere. It's slow this year, but and even with the 26 degree temperatures, this is the results of uh, covering it with frost cloth and lights. Um, I got new bloom. Right there. Um, also, my Malika that got hit, it's got bloom on it too. Um, I don't know if any of the fruit will actually set on this one because there's really not enough leaves to hold fruit. And here's the lemon zest. It's looking good. Looking really, really good. Anyway, um, that's my sugar cane, what's left of it, and thank you for watching. God bless.